Hey, listen, we need more good in this world, and the Junior League of Evansville is bringing it. Stephanie Bonnenberger is the league president, and she is here for Find the Good Day. I, I, this, I was so intrigued when I saw this mm -hmm. on Facebook. So what's the story behind it? What motivated you guys to? So uh, this is actually an international association of junior leagues. Um, project. It's our second year um, to have this day, so we will actually have leagues across six countries celebrating Find the Good Day tomorrow. Well, that's a big deal, yes. a big global deal. So yes. how are we uh, marking the day? Yeah, so our biggest thing is we want anyone to find the good, whether it's in themselves, in their community, in their families. So we are doing several things. So we have our neighborhood food market, which is an amazing project. And we are going out to the Grand Oaks apartments on Cass Avenue tomorrow um, from 5.30 to 7.30. And we have tons of free dinners. We're gonna be passing out like sandwiches. And then we also have our reduced groceries that are being available for purchase. Um, so that's one big incentive. And then tomorrow night, we are actually doing a give back at Rockabar. Oh, fun. Yeah, so we are all gonna be having dinner at Rockabar. Anyone who can come, you can come meet some junior leaguers. If you are interested in joining the junior league, um, come chat with us. And 10% of the proceeds that night, as long as you mention junior league, will come back to us. And then we're also doing a fundraising campaign. You can donate on our Facebook, on our website. You can stop by our office. But if you donate $20, we are going to take that $20 and put together kind of a little Italian dinner. And we'll announce on Facebook. And we are going to be passing out free full meals with like salad kits, desserts, fruit vegetable, a pasta. And we'll have like a meal kit for families that they can come pick up for free. And will that be at the, the neighborhood we'll food? It will be. And we'll okay. announce the date for that. Um, so we're going to see how much money is collected so we can go shopping and buy all the supplies. And then we will have those for distribution later. You know, of course, the work you do all year long is, is always inspiring. But th this kind of particular event has got to be rewarding for you guys. I mean, you're always planning something, you know, the next thing, but to see the difference it makes, it's got to be so rewarding. It is. And it's, you know, great to see our community, just how they react. And like, we had one of our busiest weekends at our neighborhood food market this past Saturday. And we partnered um, with another local kitchen here in town. Um, and so many people were able to come out and get free, or not free, I'm sorry, reduced groceries and a free meal with it. And they had some free watermelons from Feed Evansville. So it's great to partner with organizations too. Um, and just bring good into this community and help people that need it. And, you know, it, it's, it's so bring to think how many people are not uh, in the presence of healthy food mm -hmm. and uh, it's not available to them. Yeah. So, I mean, how long have you had the neighborhood market? So, it's I it's think pretty young. Is, yeah, it's about our second full year. Okay. So, it's still kind of new. We're exploring different areas. It's our first time going to this apartment complex. So, we are excited to bring our neighborhood grocery store to local markets. Are, do you have a schedule of where you're going to be? And is yep. that on your yep. Facebook page? Yes, check our Facebook. We post it every single week. Um, so, we're only going out tomorrow night this week. Uh, but typically, we go out on Saturdays. So, check that. We always announce where we're going each week on our Facebook and we hit different markets. So if, even if you don't live in that area, you can still come visit us um, to get those cheaper groceries. SNAP benefits are used there as well? We're working on it. It is okay. a work in progress. Okay. Um, we are trying to fill that application now, but hopefully by the end of the year, we will have SNAP on the truck as well. That'll be great, and I know you'll do it. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for all the Junior League does. We'll be right back. Don't go away.